Hi children, it's Miss Dimitri here and I've got a science challenge for you to do at home this week. So, we are going to try and make the perfect bubble mixture out of household products. So, to have a go at this you will need some washing up liquid, some vegetable oil, some sugar, some salt, water and glycerin. Now here's some glycerin, you can buy it from Tesco's or from the shop, it's a product that use, is used in baking. Okay, now I need to work out the best bubble solution. So, first of all you need a wand to try your bubbles with, so you can reuse a wand from an old bubble pot or you can make one. So I've got a paper straw here which is much better for the environment than a plastic straw and I'm just snipping the edges with scissors. Four times. And then once I've done that, I'm going to gently peel it back. And that is a wand for the bubbles. Okay, so have a think before you make your solution and make a prediction of what materials will be the best to make bubbles out. Think about what you see in your home. So what products are used around the home that make bubbles already? Um, a clue about the glycerin is that it's used to help thin icing sugar and make it much more smooth. So have a think about that and think if it would be good for the bubbles. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you what I think. I'm gonna add a little bit of water. A little tiny bit of washing up liquid. Um, and some oil. And I'm going to stir it with my straw and then when I want to try it I'm going to not suck it all the way up because you don't want to drink fairy liquid just gently blow okay and see if I can make a bubble if it's not successful then I know that I need to try a different solution I'm not going to show you mine if it was any good because I want you to try and find out and next week when we do our next science challenge i will show you how to make a perfect bubble and see if you got the mixture correct and you were able to do it yourself at home okay missing you all and hope you're staying safe